Good afternoon. As President of the International Council for Science, I express our appreciation to the National Institute of Information and Communications Technology for their support and five years of successful collaboration between the National Institute and the International Council for Science in hosting the International Program Office of the World Data System. I cannot stress too much the importance of data and global cooperation in enabling high quality, relevant and useful data for the undertaking of science around the world. The International Council for Science and international partners have recently agreed on an open data, big data accord, which Professor Tatsumi will speak about. The World Data System enables nations and international organizations like the International Council for Science to make positive advances on global issues. Research is increasingly dependent on access to quality assured data across multiple scientific domains, in particular to tackle the pressing challenges of sustainability and resilient management of our planet. It is vital that the data undertaking scientific research is properly preserved and fully and openly shared to facilitate scrutiny and reuse. The World Data System is a community of excellence for science, data that ensures long-term stewardship and provision of quality assured data and data services to the international scientific community. By federating national, regional and international capacities, the World Data System is promoting the establishment of a common globally operable distributed data system that incorporates emergency, emergency, emerging technologies and multidisciplinary scientific data activities. The NICT host the World Data System member, the World Data Center, Ionosphere and Space Weather, and therefore contributes also to the WDS endeavor beyond hosting the IPO. The Sendai Framework for Action on Disaster Risk Reduction is an example of how governments and the international scientific community have worked together. Our Council was the lead for the Science and Technology Major Group in Sendai, and we are very pleased with the agreement and outcomes. The Integrated Research on Disaster Risk Program, which is providing scientific support for implementation of the Sendai framework, is an example of how important data and information is. The NICT is also involved through its resilient ICT research center, which conducts research and development to strengthen disaster resistance in information and communications networks for a more resilient society. Emerging the missions of the NICT and the International Council for Science converge around these issues. The global research program Future Earth Research for Global Sustainability is also faced with data challenges and is very dependent on multidisciplinary data integration. The World Data System is playing a key role in supporting its data and information task force. Thanks to the Science Council of Japan, one of the Future Earth Global Program offices is hosted in Tokyo and is taking the lead in supporting the Future Earth Data and Information Task Force in concert with the World Data System International Program Office, also based here in Tokyo. We thank you very much for all your cooperation and we look forward to many years of working together for the benefit of all societies. Thank you very much. Have a good day.